Patriots. Bears coming up from the longtime home of the Bears. Soldier Field, the site for today's game. Now as we go to the field, it's Jacoby Jones back deep for the kickoff. Steven Gostowski now ready to kick the ball and get this game started. comes the man who's not afraid to throw it down the field, quarterback Jay Cutler. Jay Cutler has all the talent you'd like to see in an NFL quarterback, and he, he's got those good feet, can really move around, very athletic, and still one of the best throwing arms in the NFL. First down coming up. Hyde takes his spot in the backfield. Setting up screen, reaches out and grabs it. the offense here in this one will be looking to put points on the board in bunches. That leads us to second down. Cutler set. Empty backfield from the gun. And that pass is swatted away by Arrington. Looking at this defense, Gerard Mayo in on so many tackles. Gerard Mayo can diagnose the run and fly up in there. He is a big linebacker, and he's not afraid of a little pain and hitting that running back. Offense lines up here. Third and a long way to go. Jay Cutler with the deep ball. The 40 almost an interception. Jim, when you get in these situations, there's not much you can do. Third long, not easy to pick up first downs in these type of situations. Lanning is back now. He'll be punting. Edelman, he'll return this one. The ball is out. Well, one of the reasons why you put your fast guys on the kicking team because you want them to run down there and hit the returners hard. That was a great hit, causes the fumble, and they recover. Offense lines up here. To the ground, off the right side, gains five. Nice run that time. When you run the football like this, over a period of time, it's going to wear that defense out. There's no doubt about it. Nice job by the offensive line. After running it, it's second down. Jay Cutler will take the snap out of the gun. Drop back, shotgun formation. And he takes off. And that's a two-yard game. Third down. Jay Cutler from the shotgun. He'll fire it out to the left. That's an interception. They bring him to the turf. Taking the field for the Patriots. Three-time Super Bowl winning quarterback, Tom Brady. Tom Brady. Been good for so long now, year after year. Just puts up unbelievable numbers. First down at the 24. Brady, play action. Out to the left. The Patriots get a first down. Tom Brady, early in his career, did a lot of play-action passes, and they were very good at it. And this past year or so, they've gone back to it. First down at the 35. To Tompkins. Tackle down at the 46-yard line. The key to being a really good route runner and running these drag routes across the field is show some courage. Don't worry about what's in front of you. The quarterback will take care of that. It's a dime look for the defense on this play. First down at the 46. Draw. Picks up about two. Now, 
Let's talk about the offensive unit and tie it in. A man who posted record numbers his first three years in the league, Rob Gronkowski. There's no doubt the New England Patriots, they missed him on the offensive side because he's such a versatile player. A deep receiver down the field, a good blocker, and you can move him all around the field. And not for anything else, he just brings a lot of chemistry and excitement to your offense. Well, the right side, Jim, the right tackle and the right guard. They look confused. They don't know what to do, so they just get run over, and the quarterback falls down. Brady from the gun. Can't find the target on the pass underneath. Defensive coordinators love this situation, don't they? Third and long, they can do just about anything, and it's going to work, and they stop the offense that time. Jacoby Jones from the seven. And Jones to stop there. They come to the line of scrimmage. First down. Split backfield here. Here's the handoff, looking for some daylight up the middle. He's got some daylight. The Bears offensive line will be whooping it up tomorrow when they watch this play in the field room. What a good job by them. Excellent planning and awesome execution. They're able to move the chains after that last run. And we've reached the two-minute warning. New set of downs now after picking up the first on the ground. Hyde takes his spot in the backfield. They're setting up screen. Swallowed up behind the line of scrimmage. Good job by the defense. They stopped the first down play that time by the offense, and now they have a good situation. The Bears come to the line with an empty backfield. The Bears will take the snap from the 40. Looking long. Browner almost got the interception. I know we've all heard this phrase before. That's why they're playing defense, because they can't catch. Hey, the coaches don't care about that. When you get an opportunity, they want you to make the catch. Cutler steps back into the gun. Looking across the middle. Unbelievable catch. Jim, when you get in these situations, there's not much you can do. Third and long, not easy to pick up first downs in these type of situations. Not far from a first down, they're going to go for it. The give. Nice tackle. First down here after the run. I takes his spot in the backfield. Hand off. Game may be fine. And it's now second down and five after running it on first down. Jake Cutler takes a look now from under center. He'll get it again for about four. What that run does, it just puts the offense in a good situation. So a good, positive run. It's third down coming up. There's a lot of extra weight out there for this jumbo set. He's tackled beyond the markers. It's a first down. The Bears are going to burn the first of their three timeouts right here. First down all the way. Wide receivers are bunched up. Jay Cutler from the shotgun. He's looking to the right here on this throw. That's a gain of six. Offense going to stop the game here with a timeout. 36-yard field goal attempt coming up. And converts on the three. 
You always want to be rewarded for a nice drive in a football game, even when it's a field goal, because you've made a lot of good plays, you've executed them, you got yourself in position to get some points, and that field goal just reinforces everything. Takes off from the five. And the tackle's made inside the 15. So that's going to do it for this first half. We'll be back with our halftime report after the break. This is the Verizon Halftime Report. I'm Larry Ridley. Let's get ready now to take a look back at the first half. The Bears right now are doing a good job protecting their house. The Patriots haven't played horribly, but will need to improve if they want to win this one. So here we go. Let's take a look at some of the highlights from the first half. Now following the pick, the pass out of the gun will be completed, and the pass and catch will end up going for 11 yards. He's not going to test the coverage this time. It'll come out to the 20. It's first down as they head to the line. Tom Brady under center. Second half gets rolling now as he takes the snap. Good job by the defense. They stopped the offense that time on first down. Now the defense is in a good situation. Second down following the run. Snap back to Brady from the gun. Got the completion. When the defense is going to play safe and they don't want you to run by them, you've got to be able to throw these out routes where the receiver's cutting towards the sideline and the quarterback stick it in there. Brady is in the shotgun. And he hauls it in. Good job by the defense. Uh, they're well taught, well schooled by the defensive coordinator. They know in situations like this, if it's thrown short of the first down marker, they're good. They come up, make the tackle. Now we have fourth down. Jacoby Jones from the 28. And he's brought to the ground. The Bears come to the line. Starting the drive at the 37. Offense lines up here. We'll send it back to the quarterback out of the gun. Finds his mark. Charging ahead. That's what you want to do. Just get a first down, especially when you're on top. Keep the clock moving. Keep the defense guessing. Make them react instead of attack. Looking to go up top again on first down. Looks to his left. Pulls it in. Good piece of tackling. A lot of people talk about time of possession. Sometimes it's overblown, but in a situation like this, where you're winning a close game in the second half, you want to control the tempo, control the clock, and keep getting those first downs. And now he'll take off. down now offense lines up here will go ground the tackles made and the first down is picked up they're able to move the chains after that last run one quarter to go and you're watching the NFL on EA Sports New set of downs now after picking up the first on the ground. The defense needs a big stop here in order to give the offense a chance as we're running low on time in this one. The tackle is made. 
the defense has got to be a little aggressive here. Your team is down. You've got to attack this offense. You don't want them to get in there and get another score. Leading and with possession of the football, a good place to be at this point in the game. Third down on the way. Two minutes remaining, and you're watching the NFL on EA Sports. Two minutes remaining in this nail-biter. Can the offense hold on to the football and run out the clock? After that last carry, it's third and three. Jake Cutler takes a look now from under center. Again, the lean on it. That'll pick up the first. And finally, the offense comes through with a clutch on third down. First down here after the run. Goal line defense on the field. Right back to him. That brings the play to an end. They immediately call for a timeout. That's second down coming up. Good, good. The defense is ready to plug up the middle here on the goal line. And he's in for the touchdown. How about that? The fullback scores the touchdown. He does all the blocking, gets beat up all the time, but nothing like Get the football where you can score to get it done. Bears ready to kick the football. He'll take it from the one. It's out past the 20 and brought down at the 24. First down, offense readying for the snap. First down, pressure on every snap now. They go screen with Ridley. Sometimes it's good protection by the offensive line. And sometimes it's just bad defense. They can't get to the quarterback, and that's another completion. Line. Second and six. Set up screen. Has his target. He steps out. Well, when your team is behind, what do you do? Just come out there and get a first down. That's a nice job by the offense. They come out in the dime package. Brady from the gun. Brady sends it to Dobson. Second down, late in the fourth quarter. Holding on to the timeout. They'll rush back to the line. The Patriots have it at the 39. On the money, they'll mark him. At the 41, big third down on the way, late in the fourth. Hurry up, two-minute offense. The Patriots snap it at the 41, catch made. He stacked up at that point. Now on first down, every snap crucial the rest of the way. Trailing, they'll go hurry up rather than call a timeout. Fights through contact, and they can't connect. If you're defensive back in the NFL now, you've got to be alert for the deep passes down the field because not only do you got to play it well, you got to make sure you don't have pass interference. The Patriots will take the snap from the 25. And that pass is going out of bounds, incomplete. Big moment here. Third down coming up. Marine lined up in the backfield. Third down and 10. 
gets it out for the completion. And he's going to be tackled, and that's going to bring us to fourth down. They'll go hurry up now. Won't use a timeout. Ball's out. This is going to set up a change of possession. He's brought down. Well, the one thing we know about the NFL... Before we go any further, they're going to take another look at the last play. Was the knee down, Phil, or was it a fumble first? I think what we need to do here, let's stop it when the knee hits the ground. And once we stop it, let's look at the football. Does he have possession of it completely at that time? If he does, then it's going to be down. The runner will be down After before the, the play, fumble occur. The ruling on the field is reversed. Inside the last two minutes, this one had to be instigated by the folks upstairs. They challenged the call on the field, and in fact, it was the proper thing to do. The play is overturned. Yeah, good job by the officials upstairs seeing it, knowing there was a mistake on the field. That's what I love about the NFL. I'm not afraid to bet, to say they made mistakes and turn them around. Second down here. Takes the knee. Now looking at third down. For this play, they'll go with two tight ends. How much sweeter is practice going to be this week after the win on that sideline? Once you win, practice is easier because your confidence is high. You feel good about what you've done from the previous week because you won. So I think it always gives you a better chance of winning the following week because you feel so good when you're out there in that practice field.